Hello everybody, what is up all you beautiful, beautiful people? My name is Alex. Today I'm playing some more Skyrim with you guys. Come on, right now. Last we um, just got out of the um, testing area, I guess. What, you gonna talk to me? Well, I guess I'll just run off on my own. Um, I'm gonna be grabbing all the plants and stuff on the way. Um, that has a tendency to wear me off into unexpected uh, um, places and stuff like that, and uh, that's not necessarily a bad thing, I found. Um, I did that a bunch in my Oblivion Let's Play, and uh, and uh, people actually found it entertaining, you know, just running off to the side to pick up some plants, oh, more plants, and oh, more plants, and oh, more plants, and all of a sudden... Uh, you have run into a, pff, I don't know, whatever, catacomb of absolute doom and destruction, and you are having all fun, kinds of fun uh, killing off them, guys. The one thing I always do uh, when I first start a game is to kill off these guys. There's a bandit camp down here. <coughs> I can show you, uh, well, actually, I've shown, shown you guys a bunch of times before. I'm gonna go just uh, full on ramble this. Yeah, I got a little bit of an edge uh, because of that uh, sneak skill upgrade I did. But, uh, bye bye. Um, I don't think you're gonna be counting any more coin anytime soon, boy. Boyo, oh. treasure map is always a good thing to grab. Um, I'm gonna show you. Oh, he's having some bread, uh, some slaughterfish. I do want to grab the damn thing. Um, I don't think any of these are an improvement to the... Uh, well, I'd grab them anyways and sell them, uh, I guess. Improvement to the Imperial Armor I'm currently wearing. You can uh, grab this one for casters. And uh, some other crap just to sell. And uh, there is this for some more stuffs. And then there's this for the one-handers, or the melee characters. Levels up that. Nice and easy. And, uh, of course, the bow for the uh, from the uh, archer, for uh, those who are interested in arching, archery. Or being a ranged character of that kind. <coughs> so let's see, where are we? Um, yeah, this is the main road. Um, if you just wear off... Well, actually, the main road goes down there. And, uh, yeah, so you just go down the edge there, hill there, and get to that part. Hmm. Flutterbys! Let's grab them. Let's put them in my potion. Yeah. Wasn't able to. Let's go grab our, um, stone. Our star sign thingy. And... <clears throat> Let's see, I want to grab the warrior, I guess. I do want to level up my uh, those skills faster. It's the beacon! Yeah. And I always kind of go down here and kill off this, this poor uh, fisherman. Just for the experience, I guess. There's no one around to uh, the hunter, I guess, his name is. There's never really anyone around to report her. the theft of the murder, anyways. It's just to get an extra few skill points. I always do this. And some loot. Let's see, arrows, pelts, always nice. Hides, hides, meats. It has a bunch of stuff that's kind of useful. Let's see, how am I doing on encumbrance? Well, pretty good. Steal the coin purse. Crack open this chest. I don't think the chest is always locked, but uh, either way, it's, it's a nice way to get a skill point if it is. <laughs> so, um, I don't have a pickaxe. I can't grab this, though I would want to if I if I um, <coughs> had a pickaxe. 
Speaking of, let's go grab the pickaxe. I know exactly where to find one very early on in the game. Um, the Amber Shard Mine, I think it's called, or Amber Stone. Well, Amber Shard, I believe it's called. Um, it should be right over here somewhere. And I think uh, everyone <laughs> goes to grab the Amber Shard Mine you picked a bad time to get as the game starts. The only bad part about this is that I have full inventory already, and there's a bunch of loots up in there. Let's grab steel. Steel is always good for selling. <coughs> um, I should probably level up as well. Um, what do I want to level up? Um, I guess stamina for improved blockage. Um, not sure what else I want to grab quite yet. Maybe let's have a look. Leveling up. Um, yeah, let's get my stamina up so I can run faster. Well, more, I guess. Whee! Let's see. Let's get over into armors. Block. Blocking is so, so much more effective. Arrows that hit shield do no damage. What does this one do? Able to do power bash. That's nice, I guess. I never actually leveled a shield character in this game, so it's kind of cool. Uh, time slows down when you're blocking during an enemy's power attack. So I can counter? I don't know what the point of that is. Um, I think I want to grab armor, to be quite honest. Um, yeah, the smithing. Smithing is always good. It means I can make some awesome armor. Hello. I should have gone with stamina. Well, I did go with stamina actually. Oh, come on. Just drop the damn shield. This is a very more uh, dynamic gameplay, I guess. Um, I kind of had to block and then counter them as they are uh, trying to attack. It's kind of cool. Um, it's a bit different than, you know, just spamming the attack button. Um, let's see. Imperial Swords do 9, wait, 10, 23. 8, 9, 25. Let's drop that. Well, I need to drop it. Uh, R to drop, right. Actually, armor weighs more. Banded iron armor. Uh, 30. 30, 35, 200. 27, 35, 200. So, the banded iron armor is more armor. <coughs> Boots. Let's see. 11, 6. 11, 6, 25. 11, 8, 20. So there's no actual boost to wearing the iron boots, but uh, it, except for, you know, it matching. Let's see, Imperial Officer Helmut, 19, 4, 30, 16, 5, 60. Hmm. I'm going to drop one of those. I want to keep the uh, enchanted stuff so I can um, disenchant it. For, for the effects later on. <coughs> Even though I, I I'm not really planning on uh, going too deep into uh, into uh, enchanting or alchemy, but uh, yeah, that's a mishmash of armor, isn't it? Still wearing the iron boots, yeah. It looked like the uh, the leather boots from this angle. While that happens, I'll grab a drink. Ah. And then, yeah, I know there's a faster way to mine ore. Um, I just haven't bound my keys to it yet. Let's do that right now, actually. <coughs> so let's see. My main sword is going to be there. And the pickaxe, you go there. And then you press Q. That, and that on five. 
Now you just equip the pickaxe and spam the button on the orc vein, and yeah, which looks better. Uh, let's see. Did I miss anything now? No, I don't think so. There's a bunch of ore down there, I believe, if I remember correctly. I thought we had a guard posted outside. We did. I think they saw me. Or heard me. Whoa! Hey guys. I'm curious to see how shield shield gameplay works out later on. Ouch. I stand so hard I stab through my own shield. Now that's gotta hurt. Amulet of Mara. Rest those bells. I think I'm gonna do a little bit of restoration spells. Let's see. Press 5. Just spam the attack key. If you can hit the vein with us. Damn it. Come on. Follow me. Stay there. Good boy. This works. It's, uh, I think it might be faster than. Uh, might be faster than. Uh, Mining. If you can hit it, that is that's kind of a prerequisite. Okay, so that was one wine vein or vein. I mean, did he have anything good on him? No. Oh, there's some stuff down here. Let's grab that real quick. Journal doesn't really say anything useful. <coughs> Let's keep going, shall we? Um, also, there's a spell over here, if I remember correctly. Clairvoyance. Yes, sir. And yeah, I know there's a... Hey, guy. What's up? Bye. I think we just leveled up again. That's nice. That's nice, it is. Let's grab all that. Not gonna sit down. Let's open this baby. Iron boots. Um, I already have boots. I don't think there's anything else useful, super useful in here. I'm just gonna grab everything, really. Um, I'll sort through it later off camera, I think. Maybe. Um, actually, no. So. <clears throat> There's a bunch of our veins over here, I believe, um, along this wall. I can't really honestly say whether or not this method is faster than the, uh, the animation method, but uh, it seems that way, to me at least. Then again, what do I know? Uh, if anyone want to comment on that, uh, it's, it's appreciated that they do amethysts. I think this method is faster. It skips the whole animation sequence. But, uh, yeah, this is, this is a very nice place to get some early on iron uh, if you're going to be doing uh, be doing smithing <laughs> funny funny story um, well not story but the funny thing is um, back in the day when no that's a toilet I believe back in the day when I made uh, the uh, smithing guide for Skyrim back when it literally had just come out uh, I I I think someone commented saying that iron is not supposed to be pronunciated the way I say it and apparently that that, that uh, uh, argument is still going even today I still get comments on that post or video saying <laughs> no it's pronounced this way no it's pronounced this way blah 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 blah, blah. and I'm I'm just laughing at myself uh, laughing by myself, I guess. Oh crap, that hurt. 
That's kind of nice. I can interrupt their power attacks like that. It's kind of cool. Just slamming with the shield. Let's grab this guy. I think I want to enjoy shield a lot more than I did shield in uh, back in Skyrim. You heard that music there? It's like it's a oh you just cleared the dungeon uh, music, I believe. I think they kind of stole that from uh, from uh, the Diablo games. They always had that whole the whole dungeon lights up and. Um, the music plays to, you know, tell everyone that, oh, you, you're you done. Just leave now. Just leave. I'm going to go back down here because uh, I want to. And there's some mushrooms I'm going to grab. So, <clears throat> uh, maybe I can do some smithing here. No, I don't think I have the... Uh, anything in there? No. I think I have, um, yeah, I need a, uh, one of those things that you make stuff with smelters. <laughs> I need one of those smelters. Did I go the wrong way? I think I may have. No, I didn't. Well, I could have gone an easier way, but. But, since we're leaving now anyways, um, um. Very close to being over encumbered, so I shouldn't grab any more stuff. I think there's some more iron up in here that I want to grab. Or not. Okay. So, <clears throat> let's go down to, uh, what's his name? Face. And um, smelt some stuff. Well, actually, we can't. The closest smelter is actually over in um, White Run, as far as I've found. Mm, just grabbing some moss if there is any. Nope. Um, so yeah, let's go over to um, Riverwood, this town here. And uh, sell off some stuff you don't need. Start smelting and... Well, at least get, uh, get the quest to go over to... Uh, To uh, the next town, it's White Run. A dragon. I saw a dragon. Sure you did. How's the crazy old hag? So this bugged out sometime before. I want a quick save here because it's bugged out on me before. New to Riverwood, Raylof. How do you know him? If you really are Raylof's friend, I'll be glad. A drag. It would explain what I saw. Yeah. I don't know. Things just go. The Jarl needs. We need to get word to Jarl Balgrup Burger. in White Run. Brother, Mara's okay. mercy. It's good uh, some, you. At some point, it actually bugged out on me, and I lost the entire game um, because I hadn't saved any. And uh, he didn't come. And she didn't tell me to go on, and I couldn't really progress in the game at all because I wasn't given the quest to go to White Run. Uh, it's really annoying. Thankfully, there's an also save just what as you and exited the uh, the dungeon. Um, that kind of scares me. Those damn things—they they never do any damage, but they scared the freaking crap out of me because they are so good at hiding. Now this is something I commented uh, in like one of my ever first Skyrim videos and that there's a bird up here stuck in the tree making noise. Yeah. And it's been there ever since uh, I first started playing the game. No patches has ever fixed him or anything. I don't know if there's a story behind that or whatever but you can hear him flapping about whenever you get near. <coughs> Anyways, let's head over to uh, to White Run. Oh yeah, I leveled up, didn't I? Let's grab some more stamina so we can run b better, run a bit better. Let's see. Not gonna do that again. Uh, guess we'll do armor. I guess. Get some. 
get some use out of that steel armor we're about to make for ourselves. So yeah. Oh, I forgot the uh, the treasure map um, ch chest. I'll come back and grab it later. I want to farm uh, farm them shard mine. I think I think the thing is that um, those kinds of mines they they respawn every I don't know three in-game days or something like that. I'm not quite sure actually. Now usually I attack these guys. Um, and get a bunch hey, of stuff from them, it. but uh, I found that you're actually supposed, well, kind of supposed to just run down here and um, and uh, participate in the troll fight uh, with the uh, the warriors guild guys, because if you go down the lo the actually road, you come up on these guys while the fight is already over, and it's. They tell you, no, oh, you're such a weakling, because it's a bit there. Let's grab a couple of swings on this guy, and I'll get tons of cool stuff. Well, no. Yeah. You could make for a I'll get told. Field, I'll get told I'm a cool guy, an rather than eh? a weakling. Never heard of the companions? An order, and we shall yeah, solve yeah, problems yeah. when the coin is good enough. Well, see what a warrior of true metal. Strong. Come to your basker and be a companion. Yep. Maybe next time. <laughs> but let's keep on going. Oh, I forgot to grab uh, all the fat loots from uh, Rayloff's sister. She has a bunch of stuff she gives you for free. Hmm. If you heard some weird noises in the background, that's my roommate. He's making dinner. Not for me, unfortunately. But my my room is fairly near the kitchen. So that would be why. Let's go up here and Halt. City's closed with River would cause for the yard's aid. You better go on in. Mm -hmm. You'll find the yarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Come on, let me in. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. I just told you, you stupid schmo blah 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 blah. Some bitch. That's some bitch. <laughs> so, boom, we're in town. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we. Grey Mane or Battleborn. What? Got stones in your ears? I. I don't know what you're asking. Difference is. So I'll ask again. Great. I'm not Sooner or later, we all have to choose a side. Nuh uh. I don't want to. So, first thing I ever do is, you know, smelt all my ingots. Or, or my ore into ingots. And then, let's see if I can make some iron armor. Well, actually, I want to make some steel armor. Let's see, shall we? Steel. Need ingots, steel ingots. How do I make steel ingots? Ah, crap. I shouldn't have smelted all that iron. Um, I think I just need to add coal to make the iron ingots into steel. No, corundum and iron ore. Oh, balls. Well, no iron ore for me then. Well, uh, steel armor, I mean, for me. Let's just make this. Leather strips is always nice. I will always need a bunch of leather strips. Like a whole whole crap load of them. Let's see, I'm just gonna borrow your smithy here. Let's see, banded. Banded iron shields. I kinda want that. But I don't have a corundum ingot at this point. Um I don't know. Jewelry. Can't really make. What's that? That's that's new. That's got to be new with um. New with the uh, the Dawn Guard DLC. Shellbug. What the fuck is a shellbug? Shit, shellbug. 
guess it's something I need. Um, I guess the only thing we can do is improve our armor, but I can't even do that because I don't have corundum ingots. Bah! Oh, I can improve my shield. Let's make that into a fine shield. Um, I'm not going to upgrade that. <clears throat> Maybe I'll sharpen my sword a bit. I probably need steel, don't I? Yeah, I do. Um, I can use the remaining of my iron to make some daggers just to level up the skill a bit more. Iron daggers, that's the easiest way to level up your smithing, by the way, if you're curious about that. Requires one strip and one ingot. One leather strip and one ingot, see? It's really easy to level it up fast with that method. Oh, balls, I'm over encumbered, aren't I? Yeah. I hope the town is open. It probably isn't, though, is it? No. I'm gonna wait until daytime just to. PM. Well, I probably should have waited a couple more minutes there. Well, hours, I guess. I'm still closed, actually. Just do this. Usually some shops open at eight, some shop open some shops open at seven. Usually just waiting until nine AM uh, works just fine. By then all the people have gotten to their respective places. Usually. Welcome to war mate. What have the you got for here? Weapons and armor. I got the finest weapons and armor to sell you. Let's see, go to hide, imperial boots. Uh, iron armor, iron arrow. No, they don't really sell for anything. And they weigh nothing to carry. It's someone pointed out very specifically in a old video of mine. Um, leather strips, I'll keep those. They don't weigh much either. Well, actually they do. Well, not really. I just rolled all the posts, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Uh, bollocks. Keep the rest of these things, I believe. See if I can sell any. Do you have anything to sell me, though? Uh, corundum. I could. Well, I just used up all my iron, didn't I? I don't really have any gold. Good doing business with you. <clears throat> Let's set up three arl and uh, guess we'll round up the episode there after we uh, disenchant our stuff. Vegans, I can handle. This talk of dragons. So, um, yeah, I think we've done a good day's work. I work with my mother. So this is kind of, after we kill the dragon, that's kind of the point where you can start roaming the game freely, uh, completely free, without losing out on stuff, because um, if you do it earlier on, uh, you kind of miss out on the dragon shouts uh, if you do a dungeon. And you, you're not able to use them and or get them. I. I think you can get them, but you can't really, um, yeah. Also, dragons don't really start spawning randomly in the world uh, until after that point. And you kind of want that, because um, you want souls. Yeah, yeah, come at me. What's your name? What's the this interruption? Is not receiving visitors. I have news from Helgen. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Who's this then? Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Mm -hmm. So, you were at Helgen? Yes. You saw... Really? But it's none of my concern. By Ismir, Irileth was right. Blah, blah, blah. So we continue to trust in the... Let's go use your... Enchanter. Thingy. So, let's disenchant the stuff real quick. Damn it. I can't disenchant this one now. <laughs> Should have done it in the other order. Oh, level up actually. Cool, I guess. Do I have any gems? I do not. Nor do I really have any enchants useful for putting on gems. Send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my yard. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. Here, there. 
Studied in studied Imperial Armor. Doctor Faringar. Let's go talk talk to him. It seems this damnable. Hmm? What project? The Jarl can be found in the Great Hall, probably sitting on his Jarl's throne. Far over here in a I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Hmm. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Jarl thinks you can be of use to me. Kinda. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Mm -hmm. Well, when I say fetch. I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Mm -hmm. What am I going to be Straight fetching? To the point, eh? I uh, go to Bleak Falls Barrow. Find an old two. Sure thing. Ah, I'm sure some of the locals can point. Well, you must preserve some professional secrets. Must this is a priority. I have my sources. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can use the fight this dragon. Back to Bleak Falls. So, I leveled up again, didn't I? Let's get some more stamina. <clears throat> if I have stamina, I can block more. And if I can block, uh, I won't take as much damage. So I don't really need health at this point. That's kind of my logic uh, so far. No, I can't really do much else in there. Um, let's have a look in... Offensive capabilities, I guess. Maybe blocking? 20% more factor. Well, yeah. I'll grab that real quick. <clears throat> also, I got a piece of armor, didn't I? Uh, let's check that out. I think it might be the equivalent of uh, studded imperial. It's light armor. Crap. That sucks. I think, I mean, I think it might have been... Uh, or I thought it might have been... Uh, the equivalent of the banded uh, iron armor. But I think that's it for today and this episode. Um, I want to thank you guys for joining me yet again. And uh, yeah, let me know if you know uh, whether or not the, uh, the mining technique I use is faster. Uh, pulling out the mining pick and spamming the button rather than going through the animation. But yeah, I uh, hope you guys have a good day. I guess I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.